Good morning, everyone. Granny here. Praise God. One day closer to going home, y'all. One day closer. Praise God. I love the Lord. I love him so much. I love the Lord so much. He brings together things that, you know, you never know how things are going to turn out. You really don't. <clears throat> I woke up this morning with kind of a heaviness on my heart. I didn't know what it was, and I prayed over it. And I don't know, I, I debated on whether I should do a video with all this heaviness on my heart. Well, I finally got the, all this lifted off of me. I don't know why I had the heaviness. I, my husband went into work this morning. He wasn't feeling very good. And I asked him, I said, well, you come home if you don't, if you get to feel any worse or don't try to overdo it while you don't feel good. And you know, he don't listen to me. He's he's a man. He he does man things. So, you know, I pray that he's okay, you know, at work. I just, you know, he tries to work through things. That's the way he does. He just pushes forward. So, anyway, this has been, you know, all of a sudden I'm starting to feel the Spirit of God on me. And I think if, when you talk to him long enough, you know, you just start feeling it. I love how he puts joy in my heart. I really do. And sometimes he uses you guys to do that for me, you know. Sometimes I just look at y'all's comments and it puts a smile on my face. And yesterday I got a comment from my sister in Christ, my dear sister in Christ. She's been watching my videos ever since I started doing them. And she sent me a comment yesterday and I asked her if I could read it out loud. <clears throat> and she said, good morning, Granny. I wanted to share with you my weekend and how precious it was. My youngest son, who is uh, 22 and lives about 30 minutes away. Anyways, he calls me Saturday night and says, Mom, I'm going to come spend the night with, and thought we could go to church together. And he asked if I had one. And I said, no, I haven't had the courage to go find one alone. So we picked one, and we got up, got our Sunday best clothes on, and it was the most precious day to walk in with my son. Uh, he's such a polite, handsome young man. I know that Jesus put it on his heart to take his mother to, to church to worship and pray together, so I had to share. Love you. Prayer request. Grandma, she broke her hip. Uh, his grandma, she broke her hip. Prayers for Mary to heal speedily. I thought that was so beautiful. I could just, I could just about paint a picture of that. I really could. Uh, a, a, a young man walking his mother into church, you know, and praying with her. Maybe paint a picture of them praying, praying together. That would just, I don't know. It just put something on my heart. It really did. In fact, it brought me to to Proverbs thirty one. 26 through 20, uh, 26 through 28. Well, it actually brought me to the whole Proverbs, but my favorite part of it, uh, uh, Proverbs 31, but the, my favorite part of it was she opened her mouth with wisdom and her tongue is law, uh, is the law of kindness. She looketh to the ways of her household and eateth not the bread of idleness. Her children arise up and call her blessed. Her husband also, and he praiseth her. That just, it, I could just so paint a picture of how much uh, a son loving, loving his uh, mother so much that he walks her into the church. You know, that's just such a beautiful thing. Beautiful thing. Uh, so, you know, y'all's comments just touch my heart. It really does. And it, it just puts so much love in my heart. I, I tell you, th these videos have made me get into the Word more and made me pray more. I had to really pray this morning over this video. I was My heart was weighing heavy. And then all of a sudden, good things started happening. You know, I had someone, I don't think they really came against me very much. I mean, I think they were under a lot of stress. And we have her on our prayer list and have had her on our prayer list for a short time. Um <clears throat> But, uh, you know, she said some things, and I think she was just under a lot of stress, and I try to understand people. Well, today, she asked, this morning, she asked me for forgiveness, 
And I just, I, I, I just want her to know how much I, I, she didn't even have to ask. I had already forgiven her before she even knew it. And I've forgiven everybody else that's ever said anything bad about me. It's, it's okay. You know, everybody's under a lot of stress. We're all going through things. Uh, every day is a, is a new day. And I so understand. I do, you know. It's like I say, I always say, you know, it's okay to give up on me. It's okay. Just don't give up on Jesus. He loves you, and, and I love you. I, I love Jesus, and I love who Jesus loves, and I hate what Jesus hates. You know, it's just, it's in my heart. It's all about love, and I pray, I pray for, before I even pushed record, Lord, let the Holy Spirit guide me through this video, because today was... It was a, it was really hard to get on here and do a video today for me. It really was, but the joy just came over me. Uh, this uh, uh, lady had done a video and and she had mentioned me in the video. Uh, bless her heart. You know, you didn't even have to uh, do that. It you were so sweet, you know. And her videos are full of life. She just got so much. I sit and watched a few of her videos. She's so full of life. Uh, Praise Rock Design with a Purpose. She has such a, uh, she has so much life in her. I love her videos and how upbeat they are. God bless her. And I'm, I'm praying for her, her channel. I really am. I'm praying for her channel and, and we're all going to keep praying for her and, you know, that, that the Lord, that, that the Holy Spirit direct her channel. And, you know, making people smile is what it's all about. We love the Lord and we just want people to feel that love. You know, God bless her. You know, you didn't have to ask me for forgiveness, honey. I'd already forgiven you before you even, before you even asked. You're a sister in Christ. We love you. We love you. We love everybody here. We love everybody. We do. We may not like what everybody does, but we love everybody. It's, it, that's our Lord loves everybody. We love Jesus. We love who he loves. And God bless y'all. Anyway, I want to go ahead and uh, go over this list and pray for these people. We'll go from there. We let the Lord direct our path. We let the Lord lead us. We let the Holy Spirit lead us. And I've got a few new prayers and, you know, uh, so we want to pray for uh, Cindy Barnes. She's she's on here, but she's having real bad anxiety. I thought I'd add it again. Uh, she's having real bad anxiety. And I feel like that's an attack. We need to pray for her. Shannon Reed, uh, her son's uh, grandma broke her hip. And we're praying for Mary to heal speedily. And Paige Rock Design with a Purpose. Uh, she's going through a spiritual battle and we're praying for her and I'm praying for her channel, her ministry channel also, because she's trying to do a ministry channel. I, I, Y'all should go and see some of her videos. She's got a lot of life in her. I think, I think there's some hope there. I think God's going to use her channel for good purposes. So praise God. I love y'all and let's pray over these people real quick together. Uh, the Lord is with us. He's going to do lots of good things. I just I just feel it. I think he's going to do a lot of good things today. I feel like a blessing is going to happen today. I really do. So let's pray for these people. Dear Lord, we bring this list to you, Lord. And we pray, Lord, that, you, um, uh, that, that your will be done in these people's lives, Lord. We pray for each and every one of them. The healing for the ones that need healing, comfort for the ones that need comfort, uh, victory for the ones that are going through spiritual battles. Uh, we pray for calmness for the ones that are going through anxiety, Lord. So many suffering from anxiety, Lord, and we pray for those and we pray for comfort for them and, and calmness, Lord. Let your calmness be in them, Lord. And we pray for... Uh, uh, the wars going on in the world, Lord, we pray for comfort for all the families who've lost people in that in the wars that's going on. We pray for all the soldiers that are that are fighting battles today, Lord. We we pray for for uh, safety for them and um and we pray for our speaker of the house who's being attacked, Lord. 
uh, we pray for victory for him, Lord. You put him in there for a purpose, and we pray for we, he received victory over everything that's coming against him, Lord. Uh, we look for you every day, Lord. We watch for you. We pray for your return soon to come and get us, Lord, and take us out of here. We know your timing is perfect, Lord, and we wait patiently for you. We love you, Lord. We honor you, worship you, Lord Jesus Christ, King of kings and Lord of lords. We worship you. In Jesus Christ's holy name we pray. Amen. Anyway, thank y'all for your prayers. Thank y'all for all your hard work on this channel. I just wanted to do a quick video. I didn't want to take up too much time this morning. My husband's not feeling too good. He went into work anyway, so, you know, I'm, I'm hoping he comes home before he gets to feeling too bad. So I wanted to uh, do a quick video. I don't know if he's going to come home or not, but, you know, uh, we'll just see, wait and see. I'm praying for him, been praying hard for him. Sometimes we don't understand why things happen to us when we pray so hard. We know the Lord's talking to us. We just got to take some time in silence and find out what he's trying to tell us, you know. So I always go to him in prayer, and sometimes I hear from him, and sometimes I, I have to sit in silence, and there's a reason for it. So, But praise God, I love him. I know he's got something good planned for us. He has blessed us. We we just received a blessing not uh, not too long ago, and it was just a wonderful news to know that we're going to be taken care of and everything's okay. You know, uh, no matter what happens, we're going to be taken care of. But it just it's hard to watch sometimes someone you love so much and pray hard for. It's hard to watch them be in pain and hurt. So we just keep praying and we just keep pushing forward, you know, and like he does, you know, he keeps he keeps pushing forward and just keeps going. So praise God for that, that he can. But anyway, uh, I want to thank all of y'all for your comments. Sometimes y'all's comments are ministering to me. Sometimes, you know, I'll read your comments and I'll learn something something new, you know, and I'll be like, wow, I wish I'd have thought of that, you know. So y'all y'all are just beautiful people. My Lord, all of y'all are beautiful people. Uh, uh, I think uh, Miss Christian Bam, uh, Chris, uh, Bride of Christ Bam, she uh, uh, ministered to me yesterday in her comment. It just brought such a smile to my face. It really did. I, I'd have to go back and take a picture of it and read it to you because it, uh, I'll try to do that in the next video. Uh, Thursday, I won't be able to do a video because my husband's going in for his surgery. It, uh, it's not a major surgery. It's an outpatient surgery. He has to have it done every, every so often. So, uh, I'll be in there with him and, and, you know, if I get a chance to do a video, I will. It just, sometimes these things take all day long. It just seems like every time. He goes in for one of these things. It just seems like he comes out feeling worse than he did when he went in. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes. So, But God bless all of y'all. And thank y'all for your prayers. Thank y'all for your prayers for him. Uh, I pray it, it brings a comfort to him to know how many people are really praying for him. I mean, I've told him, you know, but I pray it brings comfort to him. It's, it's. It's hard to know because, you know, there are some people out there that just doesn't reveal how they're feeling. They don't talk, you know, he doesn't talk enough. He's he's kind of like one of those shy people that doesn't talk very much, you know. So I don't know how he's feeling one day from the next. I have to I have to really get it out of him. I have to stay out, uh, stay on him to get it out of him. But anyway, I love y'all. God bless all of y'all and thank y'all for everything that you do on this channel. Y'all are a blessing to me. This channel has been a blessing to me, and I pray it's a blessing to someone out there. I really do. God bless y'all. I love you, but God loved you first. And thank y'all for watching.